And hundreds of truck drivers are stuck in a blockade of a major export route out of Sudan into Egypt, hampering exports of camels and other livestock as opposition to a military takeover has fueled festering grievances over trade. Details in this report. Hundreds of trucks have ground to a halt in northern Sudan after protesters blockaded a main export route into Egypt. Further south, the capital Khartoum has seen months of protests against an October coup. But as protester Rashid Abu Zaid explains, opposition to the military has reverberated to the border. These are the fruits of our country passing through this road. This is why the Sudanese people must unite and hold a position so we can achieve the demands of this state and the Sudanese protesters who are dying in Khartoum. The protest began last month after economically struggling Sudan sharply raised electricity prices for farmers. And that's not the only grievance. For example, traders complain about the dominance of Egyptian truckers in the country and of internal restrictions they say hamper livestock exports, particularly around camels, which can be a lucrative business. Barricades of the so-called Northern Artery were then expanded by Sudan's resistance committees that have rallied protesters nationwide since the October 25th coup. By late January, some 1,500 Egyptian truckers were stuck, according to data from a trucking union. This Egyptian driver says some have been at the border for more than three weeks. We don't have any issues with them. Their problem is with their government, not with us. Sudan's military-led sovereign council has promised to address the electricity price rise without noting other issues. And the protests show no sign of waning. They also follow weeks of demonstrations that stopped shipping at Port Sudan, the country's main trade hub, late last year. Another example of how Sudan's fragile economy is vulnerable to its political turmoil. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.